What is going on guys? Welcome back. I apologize for the fan on my computer going a little bit crazy. Uh, maybe it's time for me to get some more RAM or a new computer. Okay, moving on. So what we're going to do is let's look at our faculty.php page. Let's make sure we have the same thing because this is the page that we're going to go to after we successfully log in our username and information. Where is this? Oh, it's right over here. Okay, so make sure you guys have this correct information. And uh, maybe pause the video. Let's go ahead and type it in. See how it looks. Let's go back here. Faculty. That is it. That's our H2. We got a break tag right there. Here's our paragraph text. And uh oh, what's going on? Okay, so our managed site, this goes to our content.php page. This goes to our new underscore fact.php page and we don't have anything yet for our logout page so maybe I want to look at our logout page there's a couple things we could do right now and uh, there's not really a particular or yeah okay what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to create a new file I'm going to call it um, go to new I'm going to call it login.php. So let's save it as. Where are you? Where are you? Village Park. And we'll just call it login. There goes that fan. Login.php. Let's check out our root folder. And. Okay, here it is off to the right hand side. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab all of our, let me just think about this. I'm going to open up my new underscore fact.php. And I'm just going to steal all of this, Command-A on a Mac, Control-A on a PC, and I'm going to plug it into our login.php page. Let's go ahead and save it, just like that. I can close this out. Try our login dot php okay perfect and you can change this up a little bit it doesn't have to be return to menu it doesn't have to be the exact same as our new underscore fact dot php file my fans going crazy I'm gonna let my computer chill out sorry about this video in the next video we're gonna go ahead and create um, <clears throat> our code right here for our uh, security for our password and our username on our new underscore dot fact dot php page as well as our login dot php page so good luck with this guys and I'll see you in the next video. And just for a quick recap, what did we even do? We have our faculty.php page that should look identical to this, just this small bit of code right here. So pause the video and look at that. And then our login information or our login file should be a replica of our new underscore uh, fact dot php file so sorry about this i'm gonna go ahead and turn my computer off and let it chill out for a little bit and i'll see you guys in the next video